Well, hello everyone, and here I am with a Lego Brickheads review, and this one is on the Jurassic World The Fallen Kingdom 2-pack. Okay, containing Owen and Blue. So on the front of the box, here's the Lego logo, Brickheads logo, the two that come within, and the names and the numbers of them, and the Jurassic World logo. But what I don't understand is, with all the newer Jurassic World sets, is... Why they say just Jurassic World instead of Jurassic World The Fallen Kingdom? It, can any, if anyone knows why, tell in the comments. And recommended ages 10 and up, set number 41614, has 234 pieces on the side. In film picture of Owen and Blue. On the back, the two brickheads facing each other, and how you put them on the stands in there. Down to the booklets. So, with two booklets like every Brickhead's two pack, then on the back of the first is how to win on the online survey. And then, add for the Go Brick Me set. And then, with the other one is again add for the Go Brick Me set. And the pieces that come with this set, and the last, and then for some of the Jurassic World sets and the last building steps. So first of all is the lead antagonist of Jurassic World, Owen Grady, who is of course played by Chris Pratt in the films. And of course this alongside Star Lord from the Avengers Infinity War ones, oh which now made in Brickheads twice. If they do one of Emmett next year, there will be a trio of it. Just like the minifigs and whatnot. And he has the base plate, just like all the other Brickheads, but with no prints for it and everything. You can see on the side there's a little pauldron for something, and then he has all this printing and the main torso brick Piece, which kind of well matches the in film outfit and these two one by one bricks with like pockets for his vest and then for the face I think could have had some like uh, like scruffle printings because in the films Owen does have that See, one of the hands is kind of facing up, and is holding a like rifle with the with the shot needle there for some reason. Well, tranquilizer dart, and yeah, and the hair of which molded to of which is put together pretty well, representing the like like product in it, and, and yeah, and that is about it with Owen, and now. Uh, to his uh, rifle companion, Blue. So, first time a, having a dinosaur in Brickhead's form. So, maybe eventually, let there be Indominus Rex and maybe Indoraptor, which would be kind of nice. Or maybe any kind of dinosaur characters that there would be. But uh, enough of that. You can see the legs have the like a uh, back curve or the inverted slopes to represent the like legs that velociraptors do have. And as you see, there's the like one by one uh, toothing kind of pieces to be the claws. And as you see, some like sloping for the like underbelly area. And also printed bricks on the sides. So unlike how most brickheads have it for the chest part, it's for the sides to be like the scaling details on this one. And as you see, there's it's just sand green, dark green, and a little bit of regular blue, but to represent the blue stripe that blue has. And then another tile with a bit of teeth on it. And as you see, as brickhead eyes facing on the sides, I think maybe they should like 
put them like kind of sideways ish because so we can like look forward and all you see there's not much of face this to it and as you see but also a good design for the tail on the back and but also the hands of which also similar to that but I think the arms of which could have been a little longer since they usually have kind of long arms and yeah and on to it, the final verdict. And my overall verdict is, I think, so this is a pretty good Brickats pack. Well, so you get both well, a human character and a uh, dinosaur character, and it will be unique to Brickats line. And now I will hope get the rest of the Jurassic World cast in, like Claire and uh, maybe Ian Malcolm and everyone. Yeah. And if you're a fan of the Jurassic saga, then go ahead and pick this up. If you're looking to continue your collection of the Brickheads, then go ahead and pick this up. Well, for this being a Walmart exclusive, so find it at your local Walmart. And yeah, and that is it with this video. Please like, comment, and subscribe, and thanks for watching.